y estas son las principales noticias. Mariana Tencio is there in Piedras Negras, Mexico. Mariana, what's the situation? Ali, it's a very active scene here. Moments ago, a small riot broke out inside. They started throwing a tables, chairs, and you have about a thousand people desperately waiting for ICE to refrigerate the only food that they have left in their homes. As a journalist, I travel the world. This is the kind of challenge that is raising our home now. I cover conflict, turmoil. No justice, no peace! Protesters behind me using umbrellas to protect themselves from the rain. Division. This is an American issue. But also the strength of the human spirit. And everybody's frantically just starting to organize again and to dig. There are around 20,000 people here in the city of Comerio. We've been walking with them, Hallie, for over two days now, and we've already started to see those signs of exhaustion. Ironically, it is immigrants. It is these people that are coming from Central America. I've spoken to them who still see this country as the beacon of freedom and democracy. I came here 10 years ago. English isn't my first language. I didn't have any connections, no green card. And 10 years later, I'm able to sit in this table with some of the finest journalists in the country. That is only possible in the United States of America. Let's go to uh, Mariana Atencio right now. She is in Miami. Being able to reimagine yourself beyond what other people see. That is the toughest task of all, but it's also the most beautiful. It begins by not tearing each other down over things that we cannot control, like the color of our skin or our genetic makeup. Motivational speaker, journalist, and author, Mariana Atencio. Let's get episode three of Envision started. Let's move forward. Let's take the horrible experience we've had during coronavirus, but extract all of the positive things we've learned from it. You know, saying you need to put yourself first, I think is a huge lesson, especially for women. I want my voice to represent who I am now. A Latina immigrant working hard for her dreams. You can change the future. You can write your own story and be a superhero for one person or for millions. The choice is only yours. Thank you so much. <laughs>